And I was inspired to go to law school and really further my education to, to see what I can I was inspired to go to law school and further my education to see how I can help. Kim Kardashian is using her legal knowledge to advocate for the Menendez brothers, continuing her work in criminal justice reform. In a personal essay shared with NBC News, Kim expressed her support for Lyle and Eric Menendez's release from prison, saying she has spent time with the brothers and believes they are not monsters. Reflecting on her current path, Kim shared, where I'm at in my life now, if I can influence people in other ways, just to take something close to their heart and use their platform to speak up, that's what's really important to me. In her detailed letter, she added that the men the brothers are today, in their 50s, are not who they were at 18 and 21 when they killed their parents, Jose and Kitty Menendez. Kim believes their claims of years-long sexual abuse by their father weren't fairly considered during their 1996 trial. This sentiment aligns with what the Los Angeles District Attorney revealed on Thursday, that new evidence could potentially grant the brothers a resentencing. Currently, they are serving life without parole. We have a moral and ethical obligation to review what has been presented to us and determine, from a sentencing perspective, whether they deserve to be resentenced, a representative for the DA's office stated. If there was evidence not presented at the time, and had it been, perhaps a jury would have reached a different conclusion. The decades-old case has been thrust back into the spotlight, not only by Kim Kardashian and the courts, but also thanks in part to Netflix's monster series, which delves into the Menendez family's dysfunction and what may have led the brothers to kill their parents. In one emotional moment, Lyle tells Eric, you have to shoot first so you don't back out. Eric responds, okay. I love you, Lyle. Kim has been vocal about her hopes to drive change in the justice system, saying, I'm really motivated to learn more about the law and fight for people who deserve a second chance. This mission has been a prominent theme even in her family's reality shows, where she's visited prisons on camera. One of her most recent, untelevised visits was to see the Menendez brothers, accompanied by Scott Budnick, a criminal justice advocate. Budnick told Entertainment Tonight, Kim and I have done multiple prison visits together. We were planning to go to Donovan Prison to meet with a group of 40 guys, and the Menendez brothers just happened to be two of them. He continued, how Kim finds time to give back, to inspire people and bring hope, is incredible. Having her platform amplify these efforts is so impactful. Actor Cooper Koch, who portrayed Eric Menendez in the Netflix series, also joined the visit. Reflecting on the experience, Koch shared, I had just met Kim a few days before, and she invited me on the trip. She knew the Menendez brothers would be there, and it was an inspiring moment watching them interact. They hugged, talked, and you could tell it was a meaningful conversation. A hearing has been scheduled for November 29 to reevaluate the evidence in the brothers' case and determine if resentencing is warranted.